Hey guys, just want to do a quick performance video regarding the Surface Book 3. Now, this is a unique device, but it does have some performance quirks. Uh, one of those that I've noticed especially is regarding desktop resolutions. So for example, if we have the screen set to maximum 3240 by 2160 recommended setting with 200% scaling, uh, if we look at a game like uh, Genshin Impact, uh, it's running okay, but it's it's actually kind of slow. And if we we look at the frame rate up here, you can see it's only running at about 30 frames a second or so, which is less than ideal. But what if I told you I could double that performance just by lowering the desktop resolution? Uh, now. I'm not adjusting the rendering resolution because even though it's 4K, uh, if we look at our settings, you can hit 16, you can see I have it at 1620 by 1080 resolution. And you can actually tell from the way that the game looks, it's not quite 4K clear. You can tell that the pixels are, are reduced. Let's do a very simple trick. We're going to uh, reduce our scaling to 100%. So we're going to reduce our scaling to 100%, but also we're going to drop our resolution down to 1620 by 1080 itself. Let me keep those changes. And now if I switch back, you can see our frame rate has now become a super smooth 60 frames per second. You can even see that the wattage on the GPU has gone up. Uh, for whatever reason, uh, the desktop resolution being that high can affect the performance of this game. And I've noticed that in several different areas. It works uh, in this game. It also works for VR applications. If you're rendering your desktop at almost full 4K on this device, and then try to run uh, Beat Saber or something like that, you're going to have an okay time. But if you reduce your resolution and set it down to something like 1620 by 1080 or even 1600 by 900, even 1280 by 720, uh, while you're in that VR mode, uh, you, that actually gives a bigger buffer uh, for the VR applications to work with because it's not, you know, redrawing millions and millions of pixels uh, that it doesn't even worry about. It's just a desktop display. So anyways, I hope that helps. But in games like this one, it makes a huge difference. You go from having a 30, 30 FPS kind of like, eh, it's going okay, to an absolutely butter smooth experience at a full 60 frames per second that runs awesome. So Hope this helps. Uh, subscribe if you like this tip. I do lots of Surface videos and thumbs up if this helped you out. Okay, so I have exactly one more uh, tip to help you switch between these two modes uh, very quickly. And that tip is in the form of an auto hotkey script. Now auto hotkey, um, I'll just show you the website really quick. Uh, so you just come here and you're going to click download, uh, download the current version. As long as you're autohotkey.com, this is a trustable source. I've used autohotkey for lots of things over the years. You may be familiar with it yourself. Um, but what you can do is use autohotkey and then create a script. And this script, uh, we'll go ahead and take a look at it. Um, I pulled it off the internet. Uh, there's a user who posted it on a forum and it does everything that I want it to. And what this script does is toggles between, uh, on Surface Book, mind you, Surface Book 3, 15 inch. This you'd want to use only on the 15 inch model. Um, but uh, once this script is running, you got a little icon in the bar and you can set that to run on startup. But basically what it does is right now we're in 1620 by 1080 mode. Um, but if you hold down Windows, Alt, and Page Up, it swapped us straight to 2160 full res. And then Windows Alt Page Down switches it to that 1620 by 1080 quarter resolution, which, uh, I mean, 
you switch back and forth between that, you can barely tell a difference other than the clarity because it's changing not only the scaling, uh, but also the resolution itself. But what that lets you do is quickly, you're gonna hop in a game, Windows Alt page down, put you in 1080p mode uh, for your gaming, which is gonna give you a, that boost in performance, even if your game is rendering at lower, unless it's like a full screen game that's that's changing, actually changing the resolution itself. This can give you a little boost for those windowed games. Uh, any uh, game in the App Store also should be able to take advantage because it's just less pixels to render and or uh, there's just inefficiencies with that Optimus that when you're running a 4K screen, it just slows things down. I don't know if that has to do with uh, maybe the RAM buffers, something something is off, uh, which makes it so some of those windowed games just don't perform as well as they should. So this quick script uh, lets you s quickly go back to full resolution and quarter resolution modes. So anyways, I'll provide a link to this auto hotkey script. I found it very useful and uh, we'll see you next time.